Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm doing my monthly favorites today and Cal is part of this video. You're always my favorite, aren't you? He's got his little overalls on today. So, I wanted to share with you guys, like I always have been for the past few months, just kind of my favorite things that I've been loving. Okay, so first thing is, actually I'm gonna talk about coffee because I always talk about coffee in my videos. Um, first thing is this uh, Holiday Spice Cold Brew, or actually I think it's the Sweet Cream Spice Cold Brew. Oh my gosh, it is so good. I talked about the vanilla one, the vanilla sweet cream cold brew from Starbucks, but this one just kills that one. Like this is so good. It's just the right amount of sweetness. Like it's not very sweet, but it's got those spices in it. It's just so, so delicious. I love it. I cannot get enough of it. Um, another coffee that I'm loving, I don't have it to show you guys because I drank it all, but I found it at Target and I think there's lots of different varieties of it but just getting like a jar of cold brewed coffee. The one I specifically got was called Chameleon Cold Brew and it was organic and I got a vanilla flavor once and I also got a caramel flavor and it's like a jar like this big and it's $9.99 so it's expensive but it's really really good and it's like saturated or concentrated coffee and it's so delicious it just stays in your fridge and then it's ready to go be poured over ice and added with um milk or whatever you choose but that's a really good one and then my other favorite coffee this month is the holiday blend starbucks k-cups these are also really yummy for a hot coffee so those are my coffee faves uh, moving on to beauty i do have one beauty product this month and it is a facial scrub this is um, formula 10.0.6 and it's called One Smooth Operator Pore Clearing Face Scrub. I got this at Ulta and I really, really love it. Um, it's got a really good thick consistency with big chunky like beads in it and it just really scrubs and cleans your face really well. It was like $6 and I just bought it on a whim and when I went to check out the Lady was so excited. She's like, I love this face wash. Oh my gosh, like you're gonna have no pores. It's gonna be amazing. And then I tried it and I really, really like it too. So they have a whole line of products, um, but this one I really, really like. Did you spit up? Oh. Next thing, um, I usually talk about books. And this month, I always do Audible. I love Audible. It's the only way I can do a book because I'm just so busy with him that I just don't have the time to sit down and read a book a lot of times. So I love doing Audible. I listen to it when I'm putting away his laundry or when we're driving places. I listen to it in the car. So the book I'm loving this month was called The Bullet, and I'll link it down below. It's a really good, if you like mystery, murder, thriller type books, it's really good. Um, another thing for reading is blogs. I love blogs. I just never find, it's like blogs are hard because I don't know, you just never find the time to like sit down and read someone's blog. But a lot of times I'm scrolling through Pinterest and that's how I find a lot of blogs is I click on pins and then it takes me to someone's blog and it, it's an article on their blog. So I found this blog called The Art of Making a Baby and I think she started in 2010, so it's like six years old, and her daughter is four, and I just love her insight on motherhood, and she talks a lot about um, breastfeeding, and she talks a lot about parenting, and just all kinds of things, and I really, really like her outlook on all of it, and so I really like her. Also, you've probably heard of her because she's very popular on Instagram is Carmen the Modern Mom. I like her blog as well. So again, she talks a lot about the same things and I like her outlook on parenting as well. So I like to read other people's experiences and things just like with YouTube. I love watching videos and stuff kind of when you're going through the same things and you know when you're pregnant or when you have a newborn. I like to kind of see other people's um, how they're handling situations and their advice and stuff. So I found her blog and 
I she just had so many great posts but I wanted it to be like something I could come back and read later so if you guys have heard of the app blog loving <laughs> what if you guys have heard of the app Blog Lovin', you should definitely give it a shot. Um, I think I had it a while back and I guess I never used it. Yeah. But basically it's, um, you can follow all the blogs that you like from any source pretty much. Um, so you can follow different bloggers and it'll put all of your blogs into one feed sort of like an Instagram feed but for your blogs and you can like you can like them you can pin them or you could save them so I followed her on blog lovin and then I just went through all of her posts and I saved all the ones that had topics that interest me so now I can go through whenever I'm like breastfeeding him I'll just go through and I'll read one of her blog posts um, and I just think that that's a really convenient way to do it so if you guys know any blogs that you really love like mommy blogs let me know below so I will go and check them out on blog Lovin so I can add some more to my I have like a little list called mom life and I've just been saving blog posts to that so that I can read them later so that's what I've been enjoying as far as reading goes and food I have one food product and it's bread it's this what is the brand Aura Wheat, extra grainy. It looks like this. Oh, there, there's a good shot. So this bread is really good. I found it at Target. I like my bread, like really grainy. So this one is delicious. It's got like all the seeds in the bread, not just on the crust, and it's really yummy. And then I also have a fashion item this month. I talked about these shoes in one of my vlogs, but I'm just obsessed with them, so I thought I'd share them on here as well. He's such a talker. Do you want to tell them about the shoes? <laughs> They're these um, lace up pointed toe ballet flats. I got mine at Target. I have seen them in other places too. They probably are a knockoff of the designer. Um, but these are a burgundy velvet color. Okay, he was over that. So these, where was I? These shoes. Um, I also have them in black and brown and I love them. They are just super cute, super chic, comfortable, inexpensive. I love Target shoes. I think they have the best shoes for the value. I love them. Um, lastly are going to be my baby favorites for this month. First off are baby wipes. I had only used Pampers Sensitive Skin up until now. I grabbed these up and up brand which are just from target i should like be a spokesperson for target <laughs> everything i buy is from target um these are just the sensitive skin baby wipes and i don't know what it is about them but i really like them they're just they just have a really smooth wipe like when you wipe it just picks everything up very smoothly i really like them um they're cheap i think they were the cheapest option probably when i went and looked so I think they're great. Another thing are bibs. Oh my gosh, this one's actually soaked. He just had this one on. <coughs> this is a little Santa one, but I have so many of these now. I've been buying them like crazy. He goes through like five a day, probably. So this, this brand is Katie Baby, but I'll link a few different ones below from Amazon. I just get all of mine on Amazon. There's all different brands, all different styles. Um, just make sure if, if you're getting them for drool. Um, I really like the bandana ones because they're cute. But then also most of them will have like a really nice felt back. So they're very absorbent. Like it's soaking wet on the top, but there's it's completely dry on the back. So it doesn't get their clothes wet um, which is the main reason because if I don't put a bib on him, his clothes get soaked and you have to change him. And also, they can get a rash. He gets a little rash around his mouth now from all the drool. All the drool. Um, so if they get it on their clothes and stuff, they can start to get a rash on their chest and neck as well. So these keep them rash-free and dry. Lastly is a little diaper changing pad. This was sent to me by the brand Cutie Bee and I love this. 
I will link it below. It's from Amazon. And what it is, it's like this. It's very cool. Um, I have a similar one that came with my Fisher Price Pack and Play, but it's not quite as elaborate as this. So this one's really nice. You've got the bottom part here that's so big it's hard to show, but it opens like this. There's actually like a cushion right here for their head, so that's really nice. It's completely like wipeable, so it's really nice when you are traveling or on the go. It's got spots for diapers, and then it also has a mesh pocket, a zipper pocket here, and an outside zipper pocket, and a little clip to just like clip it onto your stroller. And the whole thing just folds up really nice and compact. And I think it's a great option if you don't wanna bring your whole diaper bag into somewhere, you could just bring this and then you don't have to like worry about the whole diaper bag. You could stick, you know, a couple little um, medicines or anything like that. Like I always like to have gas drops with me. So you could stick your gas drops in here, the wipes and the diapers and you're good to go. Also, I like it for traveling. I obviously don't take a changing table or changing pad when we're traveling. So this is awesome like for my parents' house to just use this. And then another thing I noticed recently, we've been decorating and we live in a ranch style house. So we have a finished basement and I've been down there a whole lot. And I like to keep this down in the basement so then I don't have to come upstairs to change this diaper. So if you live in a two level house, it's also a great option to have like one of these little travel ones to use. Um, so all in all, I just really like this product. I think it's awesome. If you are a mom on the go, this is the type of thing that you need. So those are all of my November favorites. And if you guys have products and things that you're loving this month, let me know in the comments below and I will talk to you next time. Bye.